Oh, Papa Rat. Oh. What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel, welcome back to the vlog! The sun is shining up in the sky, it's as usually a beautiful day here in Playa del Carmel, Mexico, one of the best locations for your 2019 summer holidays. Okay, I like. Maybe it's not the best looking good day, but believe me or not, it's still a beautiful day for me. I really love this place. You know, when you really love, you can see beautiful everywhere, all around. As you guys can see, the beach is full of seaweed. The ocean is dirty, and uh, there are a lot of waves. It might be even dangerous to swim, and uh, the sun, the sun is up in the sky behind those couple of clouds but uh, it's still a beautiful day for me today is the 29th day of my stay in Mexico what does it mean it simply means then tomorrow my Mexican tourist visa it's going to expire tomorrow is going to be my last day which it doesn't mean that my holiday is going to finish it just mean that my actually Mexican holiday is going to finish in fact tomorrow I'm flying back to Miami and the day after I'm going to Grenada a beautiful Hainan located right in the middle of the Caribbean Sea it's going to be there where my next adventure a catamaran trip it's going to start guys make sure to subscribe to my page below make sure to smash this subscribe button and watch all my beautiful adventure this time is going to be amazing Coming back to today, I actually started to work about one hour ago, in fact, we, I finally reached the Calle 88 and uh, once on the beach I keep walking direction north, I'm going to show you a secret place, a place where there are almost no tourists, a place where you will really see Mexican people having relax and some chill time. It's a secret place, it's a unique place. Believe me or not, there is a cenote right in Playa del Carmel. This is just a one hour walk from your accommodation. That's the only one reason why no one knows about it, you lazy traveler. And here we are, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the only one beach in Playa de Camel owning a blue flag for the year 2018-2019. What do you guys think of this place? Thumbs up or thumbs down for Punta Esmeralda? And here we are, ladies and gentlemen, we we'll finally reach the secret cenote of Playa del Carmen. Oh, everybody watching me are screaming. But look at this, it's really beautiful. I have to be honest with you, I thought it was better. The truth is that I just came here yesterday and believe me, it was really a beautiful day. I get to know about this place because uh, in my hostel, talking with a local guy, he mentioned a cenote in Playa del Carmen and uh, I got very interested in this place because uh, I knew there's no cenote, but 
What this local guy explained me is that local people actually consider this place as a cenote. In fact, going around for the city, you are never going to mention Punta Esmeralda Beach. This is a touristic place. Talking about this special location with local people, you are going to mention the cenote and everybody will understand that you are talking about this place. Now, what happened today is this. It's cloudy, it's windy. Right now, it's starting to raining again. During the night, we had a storm. The beach is full of seaweed. How was the situation yesterday? Everything was beautiful. It was sunny, there were no clouds in the sky. There was absolutely no wind at all. The beach was just full of soft sand. What happened today? Mother Nature apparently didn't like me. She didn't like the idea of me showing you this secret place because in fact this is actually a secret place. Sunset time and from Playa Esmeralda for today that's it uh, guys as usually thanks very much for following my channel I really appreciate you watching my video so make sure to smash a thumbs up if you would like to know something more about Playa Esmeralda, Playa del Carmel or simply Mexico make sure to write me a comment below and I will answer all your questions ciao